Welcome to a video from the DigitalLifestyle.com New Windows 10 build to look at, this is 17711 uh, This is for Redstone 5 build for Windows Insiders of the Fast Ring and for Skip Ahead So the main changes with this build are in Edge and some UI improvements If I go into uh, reading mode on a page like this see The toolbar now has some options You can have page themes now um, to help with uh, reading of the pages and then you can change the line focus on here so you can really focus on a couple of lines or an area of text as you're reading it uh, interesting way of, of working with that but uh, those are ch those are the changes on those also changing this is if you notice it's subtle but uh, a slight change if, if I bring up a menu you can see that there's like a bit of a drop shadow around it this is part of the changes with uh, fluent design and uh, to sh to make things a bit easier to see I guess that's the, the way to describe it so I could go like that open a link and you see you've got that sort of shadow around it to show that um, it's a sort of a level in, up in front another change is the window HD color settings you can now uh, in there that's now included in settings the my monitor doesn't support any of these extra settings but there's the options if they were there so there's been a change to reg edit now it, you can um, it's giving you the predictive text on there and uh, yeah that's it you can just start typing a letter and it will remember it will sort of prompt you of, for the next one which I think is great so you can have it like that so I can start typing and if I can't well, I remember what it is, but there it is. So, other changes. Well, with this build, um, as a reminder, has no uh, option of sets in it like previous builds, except for the last one. Sets is something that's not included in this build and probably won't be included in Redstone 5. So, that was the tab, everything had a tab. So, settings would have a tab, reg edit would have a tab. That's gone and may re make a return in a future build. They fixed on uh, UWP issues and emulations and some rebooting issues with uh, ReWPs. They've turned off the acrylic background in Task Manager so it's a bit cleaner. They've refixed some game issues, fixed some narrator issues, and they fixed the issue with Windows Mixed Reality, which made you get stuck after going into sleep um, d displaying a, a, an error message. So that's now been fixed. There are some known issues. They're still working on dark mode. A few people ask me why I'm not in dark mode. I just found it easier for doing these videos in, uh, without dark mode. Uh, they fixed them. It multi There's still some issues with multiple monitors, um, secondary displays, and so on. But that's the changes. Not a huge amount of changes with this build. We've seen those changes now in in Edge. We've seen and some of the uh, uh, UI changes and I think what they're focusing on now is getting this clean and ready for um, the August uh, bug crash which starts at the end of July 27th of July and then it will be on to release so thanks for watching this video you can see more on the digitallifestyle.com on our YouTube channel let me know how, what you think of the videos I'll see you on the next one